what's the benefit of certification and which uh, certi Microsoft certifications are high in demand right now? So the benefits of certification, I think, still remain. It's a validation from a vendor like Microsoft that the skills are there. So it's, you know, it's a proctored test. Uh, the ID is checked so that we know the person who took the test is the person. They, you know, their skills um, are tested. We've got really great new technology around how we test those skills in a more hands-on way versus just a multiple choice tests. So it really is representative of a skill level that somebody has once they take and pass that certification. So there's value there to whoever's using it to evaluate the person. So if I'm a company and I want to deploy some technology, I'm looking at partner, Microsoft partners, and they bring in a person for me to, to, to work with, and I'm going to pay this person a, a contracting or consulting fee, I want to know that they've got the skills. So the certification plays that role, and it will continue to. Um, I think certification will evolve. We're seeing a lot of changes in the way people are testing and what they're looking for. As technology advances rapidly, the cadence is, is really difficult to keep up with from a certification perspective. So we're looking at new ways to augment certifications to make sure that they're up to date. So when you hire in that consultant, you know that not only do they have the base level of skills, but they have the newest technology skills as well. So that's sort of the benefit of certification. On the what's hot right now in certification, I would say there are four areas that are, that are really hot. One is security. Uh, lots and lots of, of people are interested in certifying in security, and lots of companies are interested in hiring people with a good security baseline knowledge. Uh, the second area is cloud computing, and this is virtualization, both public cloud and private cloud. Third is application development, and that's an obvious one, right? As with the proliferation of devices, applications are, are critical to being able to use those devices uh, effectively. And then the fourth is uh, big data. Mm -hmm. And that's really a hot area. It's really going to enable Internet of Things. It's also enabling just cloud services and personalization um, and knowing your customers. So I think big data is another new area of interest for many people who are seeking certification. Mm -hmm.